Hi everyone, I'm Major Melanie Klusner, call sign Mock. I'm the pilot and commander of the F-35 demo team. So I'm here today to take you on a brief tour of the F-35A conventional takeoff and landing version, and I'll show you some of the biggest highlights of the jet, some of the most common things that I get asked questions about. So let's start over here on the left-hand side of the aircraft. What you'll see here that looks like a mirror is actually called a DAS camera, so distributed aperture system. We have six of them located all around the aircraft, and we have the capability to fuse all of the images that these cameras produce together and display them on our very technologically advanced helmet inside of the cockpit. So this helps us do things like see through the floor of the aircraft if we wanted to, uh, more commonly used for night vision capabilities. Another very commonly asked question is what is the shiny looking thing on the front of our aircraft? This is called our EOTS, Electro-Optical Targeting System. Uh, it's a fancy name for a targeting pod, so it helps us identify friend from foe while we're flying overhead. Uh, we can zoom in on the ground, we can track moving vehicles, we use this to guide in some laser-guided weapons as well. So in the nose of our aircraft, uh, this houses our radar. It's a very, very powerful radar, gives us a lot of situational awareness to see exactly where our threats are on the battle space. Something you'll notice about the F-35, uh, unlike legacy fighters, is there's no weapons or weapon mounts on the wings. We do have the capability to do that, but the name of the game for the F-35 is stealth. So all of our bombs and missiles are typically housed underneath the jet in our weapons bays. So when you hit the red pickle button in the cockpit, those doors will open, weapons will come out, and the doors will close back up again, uh, returning us to our stealthiest capability. Most powerful fighter jet engine ever built so Pratt & Whitney F-135, it's got 43,000 pounds of thrust. So if you're here at the Paris Air Show, I'm sure you've heard it, you can feel it in your chest, especially on the last maneuver that I do in the demo, the tactical pitch. Uh, when I rotate to 135 degrees, I point the engine right at the crowd and you can feel the raw power of our engine.